Hi everyone, I'm Hebba and welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I have no makeup on, so it's masking time. Yay, I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm going to be doing a mask that you've probably seen all over YouTube. It's a Korean skincare mask and here's the box right here. It is by Eliza Vecchia, no, Eliza Vecchia Milky Piggy Carbonated Bubble Clay Mask. Try saying that a few times. There's a cute little box. There's a little pig right there and it looks like he's got a mud mask on his face. That's really cute. Now my husband and I, we went to New York last month and we uh, shopped in Chinatown and I saw this mask there. I think we bought it for maybe $15 there, I wanna say. I can't remember, I honestly can't remember how much we paid for this. You know, I wanted to try this over the summer and I bought one on Amazon. And when I bought it, and opened it, it didn't look like what I've been seeing on YouTube. And even the box was kind of different. So when I went back to Amazon to check it, there was, I guess, a flag on there and they took the, the page off. So I was getting kind of worried about that. So I didn't want to buy another one off of Amazon. So when I saw it there in Chinatown, I figured, you know, it may be, may be legit buying it from there. <laughs> you know, if, if you want to get this, I would chop around especially on Amazon, because you don't know where it's going to be coming from. So, you know, that's my advice for you guys. But again, when we saw this in Chinatown, I picked it up. I figured, you know, hey, what the heck, let's just go for it. And let me do a video on it. So here it is right here, and we're going to try it together, see how it works on my face. <laughs> now it says that it can cleanse your skin, so it can remove your makeup. That probably I... Probably won't do. No. <laughs> I don't know about that one. But I'm going to use it as a mask where it, can, it, where it says it, it unclogs your pores and exfoliates your skin. So I'm going to try it that way. So as you can see, my face is clean. No makeup on, so I'm not going to worry about the, if it works as a cleanser. And some of the ingredients, the box is in Korea, in Korean. But they do have... In English side and let me read that to you. I need my glasses. It says here take proper amount of carbonated bubble clay mask to your whole face except around the eyes. After three to five minutes when the bubbles blown up absolutely. <laughs> That's funny. Do foam massage with a little tip of water and wash away. Okay we're gonna do that. Now I did some research and I saw that some of the ingredients are there's charcoal powder, there's green tea extract, uh, pomegranate extract, and it says it has collagen in there. So we'll see. We'll see how it works. <laughs> well, let's get to it. Okay, here's the jar right here. There's the jar, and as you can see, there's green writing all over it. And I didn't open it yet, so let's open it. Okay. Okay. There it is. And it comes with a little spatula, which is always nice. And it comes with a little cupboard here. Oh, let me put the spatula down. Oh, okay. Luckily I'm wearing an old shirt. <laughs> it smells kind of clean. It smells really good. I like the smell. And here's the texture of it. It's kind of thick. So I wonder what happens if I put it upside down. Oh look, nothing's coming out. <laughs> okay, so the one that I bought from Amazon, it was really runny. So that's why I didn't even try putting that one on my face. No, so I threw that one away after I saw that. <laughs> no. Here's the spatula. Let's go in. Ooh, it's got a really thick consistency. Kind of slimy. Ooh. Okay, can I get it on the spatula? Okay, there it is right there. Let's go. Let's go. I do like the smell. It smells really good. I wonder if this is like... I, I did another mask. Uh, another first impression mask. In the Malin and Getz. Malin and Goats, I believe that's how you say it. The Detox Face Mask. And that one bubbled up. That one was really fun too. Okay, let's get it. Let's get some more. Probably I shouldn't put that much on because it will bubble. Probably not around my mouth that much. 
Let's use my fingers. But I do like the smell. The smell is really nice. Okay, let's put it all over my pores. I want it to unclog my pores. There it goes. It's starting to bubble up. Yeah, I feel that. I feel it bubbling up in this one. Okay, oh, let me look at the time. It is 11.21. 11.21. So I'll probably rinse it off at 11.26. I'll, I'll let you see it at 11.26. <laughs> see what it looks like. Ooh, I do feel it fizzing on my face. And I hear the crackle. Yeah, it's tickling my nose. I feel it tickling my nose. And I feel it tickling around my lips. <laughs> it's really tickling. Oh, okay. I can hear it popping on my on my face. I feel like I missed a spot on my nose. I wonder what happens if I put some. Okay, I had to put some on my nose. That's all to make it even. Mm, we'll see. <laughs> it's not too bad. So far, two minutes have passed. Yeah, I'm kind of glad I didn't put that much around my nose because I learned that from the Malin and Getz detox face mask not to put it that much because it does expand and it gets suds, it get, has that sudsy uh, texture. And I want to breathe. <laughs> so, yes. Don't put it near your nose or your eyes because it will expand and it will get in there. <laughs> it does make my face look fuller. <laughs> I'm going to zoom in. What do you think? Oh, it's fun. It's fun. It's fun. Okay, it is 11.26. Okay, and let's, it said to massage it in, so I will do that. I'll, I just want to see what it looks like. Wow, did you hear that? <laughs> wow, that's fizzing. It still has that, that nutty texture to it. Okay, I'm going to rinse this off and I'll be right back. <laughs> That's fine. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> it took a while to take it off. <laughs> I had to get a, a washcloth and just kind of help take it off. <laughs> But, you know, it does make my face look cleaner. I don't feel that it's drying my skin out. But yeah, I don't think it dried. It didn't dry up my face. I don't feel that it's dried. I do feel a little tighter, I guess you could say, in my, in my skin. It feels a little tight. It feels clean. It feels cool and refreshed. That's, that's what I'm feeling right now. Let's see here. Let me zoom in here. What do you think? It did clean my skin out. I really like that. And, you know, I like fun masks. Those are always fun. <laughs> I love doing fun stuff. Gosh, if I could just have that pulled back like this, it'd really get rid of all my pores. Look at that. But this is what I have. This is what I have to deal with. But I really like it. I really like how it feels. I'm kind of glad that I didn't use the one I got from Amazon, the, the one I got during the summer. I believe it was during the summer. Didn't look legit. <laughs> I'll just say it that way again. For me, I would use this again. I would use this again. I really like it. I really like it. I'm glad I bought it in a place that, you know, I, I believe it was Tony Moly, the store in Chinatown that I bought it at. Yeah, I like going to those Korean uh, skincare shops. They have really interesting things in there and a lot of them work. I really like it. I really like it. This is a yes for me. I really like this. Uh, it's kind of like the Malin and Getz one, the detox face mask that I, I did a first impression. And I'll put a link to that video down below. 
I like that too. I like the smell of that one too because it smelled, you know, like almonds. And this one smells very clean. It smelled, it smelled very nice. I liked it. I like it. I really like this. I like, I'm going to say the name again. Eliza Vecca Milky Piggy Carbonated Bubble Clay Mask. <laughs> I just love it. And I like that it comes with the spatula. Let me look at it again. And yeah, that's, that's how much I used. Just that much. All right, I really like this mask. Now, if you want to try it and get it, I would do some research first and make sure wherever you get it from, it is a reputable place that you get it from. And with Amazon and skincare, it can be a little iffy depending on where it was from. So I would do that. And or if you were near a Korean area, Korean shopping mall, a, a Korean you know, area in your town, I would go there and see if they would have it. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching this first impression video of, I'm going to say it again, <laughs> of the Eliza Vecca Milky Piggy Carbonated Bubble Clay Mask. I have to look at it to make sure I say it right. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button, please, so you can see more videos like this. And you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.